From Masaka, Geoffrey Sekatawa has worked on his oil refinery business for over seven years, and he believes now is the time for his business to kick off. So how does Geoffrey turn used oil into new oil? From the be beginning of the machine age, oil is used as a lubricant. This oil works uh, to serve a number of functions in an engine. But due to those number of functions it serves, it gets dirty. For example, this is black oil. It was once called in yellow, but now it's black. What made it black? The unburnt fuel in the engine, uh, the soot from the engine, uh, dust from the working conditions of the engine, water, which, is, which gets into the engine when they are washing, and so many other sources of contaminants. For us, we collect this black oil, we bring it and stock it into this drum. This is the drum where we stock black oil. After stocking black oil, then we start working on it. As we are working on the black oil, we first put it into this drum. This is a small drum, 26 liters capacity. In this drum, we mix it with acid. As it is mixed with acid, it is boiled up to, it, up to a temperature of 46 degrees Celsius. At 46 degrees Celsius, we maintain it at that temperature for a period of 30 minutes, whilst continuous stirring is being done. At that, we let the oil sit for a length of 12 hours, such that the acid can break down the build-up impurities into the oil, and then they settle down as a sludge. The sludge is a thick bituminous uh, substance which settles at the bottom of the oil while the oil floats. Uh, in our final stage of oil refining, uh, we do what we call vacuum dehydration. We do this vacuum dehydration to turn the oil from this color of yellow into the final golden yellow color which is for the purified oil. We use this rotary evaporator. So now let us run you through how it is used. All these drops are coming from inside here. It is water which was originally contained into the oil. Now it has been dehydrated and we shall remain with a clear yellow oil in this flask. Well, after the oil has been dehydrated, we now harvest it and we add additives. This is additive addition. After adding additives, we now blend them to mix thoroughly well. What I'm doing is additive blending. Now that it is mixed well, we are going to pack the oil into a one liter bottle. This is a finished product which is of high quality, blended with extreme care, and it's going to provide 